Here we go. We're going to try this maneuver that has been eluding me for quite some time because it is a rather steep entrance and exit for this. And plus, if you fail, it's a long flight back. So it really has been daunting to do this one. But I'm hoping with this Mighty Mouse series, I'll be able to attempt and complete this. Uh, the wings are small enough. The craft is small enough. So I really hope that this will work. It feels like we're going slow enough. I have still forgot to put on my air brakes, so my air brakes are still no good. They are on there, but they are currently not usable because I can't activate them both at the same time. So, here we go. We're going to attempt it. We're going to try it. Whoa. We got to get down nice and low. And through the loop we go. <laughs> oh, man. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Oh no, 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 no. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we can do it, but we need more power when we're going through. Oh, that is such a long flight back. All right, I'll be back. All right, so we're coming up on our approach once again, and hopefully. I can nail it this time because let's be honest, this flight takes a long time with Ion and oh my god, just to get over here and get this set up is really time consuming. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my air brakes which I finally put on properly and have mapped out properly and see if I can use those to actually slow me down enough to make it through and to get out in enough time. So here we go. And we're going through. And now for the bug out. There we go. <laughs> oh. Whoa. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh. Okay. It's not as hard as it looks, but it is definitely quite difficult. So yeah, that that works, that works. Unfortunately, I know I don't have enough ion to make it back, so we're gonna have to actually have to land on this island. So let's go ahead and get our gear out here and get prepared. Okay, and come on, come on because we don't have much ion left. Let's go ahead and kill it, matter of fact. Whoa, without killing anyone. Go ahead and uh, throw up our air brakes here. And land this beast. Nice and, nice and easy, nice and easy. I love these air brakes. I'm telling you, I love these air brakes. Oh, man, makes life a lot easier. <laughs> All right, so we have touched down. We can actually do a recovery. And uh, there you go. That is Mighty Mouse 4i, the Ion version. And it can fly really well. Uh, that is... It's kind of a challenge, not really so much. But I have another craft I want to show you. So stay put, and hopefully this will work out. All right, so this one's called BX1. Simplistic name, awesome looking craft. <laughs> Take a look at this one. There you go. That is it. Now, I'm still building really small craft. But this one looks pretty cool. Oh, that's not looking good. That's not looking good. Not looking good. Whoa! <laughs> that was looking really bad. Um, I had a really poor attack on that one. 
as you can see, if you do that wrong, a lot of bad things can happen in sequence, uh, like what you saw right there. All right, so let's see if we can loop back around. All right, spin it, spin it, spin it. Whoa. Ha! <laughs> All right, get away from the building. <laughs> oh, this craft is awesome. Oh, it is very awesome. It can do some extremely steep maneuvers, which is really impressive for a craft of this size. I don't even know where we're at. Oh, no. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Way too steep. <laughs> oh, well. Well, that craft is pretty awesome. But this one I actually like a bit more. I actually found a new mod that adds in a lot of these frameworks. I'll add in the description in the in the oh, I'll add in the link and the name to the mod in the description below because I happen to forget it at the moment. So this one actually just hovers up a bit and it uses as you can see here USI uh, ducted fans for mobility. So I can actually throttle this up and it will move forward for me. I don't just have to drive it around, uh, which is fantastic because it lets me do quite a few things. Oh, uh, what are you doing? What are you doing? I didn't say anything about turning that direction. So the goal is to land this on Brunhilde. Let's see if we can do it. I think it's lined up on this road when I left it. We're just going to pass over some of these uh, other structures and this parking lot that's new in here, uh, thanks to the mod. I really should have looked up the name so I wouldn't have to say the mod. So mod creator, I do apologize. I'm just not feeling that well today. <laughs> so my brain is not functioning 110%. Or even 100%, or even 50% like is normal for me. So hopefully we won't do any braking. <laughs> and get our nose down, down, down. And here we go. Ooh, we're going so fast. Uh. <laughs> But <laughs> we're going slow enough not to break anything, which is always a benefit. All right, excellent. Nothing broke, which is why I have that bumper there, and that's why I aimed in the middle. And uh, we have successfully landed on Brunhilde. I probably need to lengthen that out a bit and put some landing guides in, but the Brunhill is not quite done. I just happened to leave it out here, so there you go. <laughs> so this is the newest in the Mighty Mouse series, Mighty Mouse 4 once again. Uh, this is the Ion version, and if you like this craft, you like Brunhilde, or you like BX1, even though it smashed and blew us in... It blew itself up. It wasn't me. <laughs> if you like those graphs, definitely let me know. Uh, I can definitely dump them on Kerbal, X, on Kerbal X so you can download the craft files and fly them for yourself and see if you can have fun. Once again, these fly with stock aerodynamics. I have not tested them in Ferrum, and I'm pretty sure they would not fly in Ferrum. But nonetheless... Uh, this one would require tweak scale. It would require, of course, your stock values, and it would require B9 because that is where I get the uh, the air brakes come from B9. So just keep that in mind. But if you like what you're seeing, hit that like button. Drop me in a comment below. Let me know what you think. I will also in the description drop in all the mods that I have used in this one. And hopefully you have enjoyed the video. I know I didn't do many stunts in here. I accomplished the last stunt that I wanted to accomplish with this series, this craft series. So I guess the next venture is, I don't know. I don't know. 
know. I'll, I'll keep that up to my imagination. But for now, I'm going to get on out of here. This is your boy, Jatois. Subscribe if you have not yet, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. This is a little light lighter. I am uh, still amazed. Ooh. 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 Well. And there we go. Moving around for number two.